You think about a scourge? A scourge is made of many spectres merged. Not always. A harvester, for example, is a scourge born of a single spectre. A scourge will always seek a new physical body, often made of different materials. Very poor. Perhaps you'd prefer an easier question? On the nature of a ghost, perhaps? Ghosts have ties. Objects through which they're bound to someone living. You are the opposite of Charles. Good at the practical, terrible at the academic. I hope it's enough. Do you hear that? Over here. Oh, Fardy! Did you see that? Let's follow it. Watch out! Spec Shelter with a damp and itchy straw bed. Just how I like it.
There's a name. Rebecca Hardgrave. Wait! Please! I am lost without you!
Are you Rebecca Hardgrave? That's my name, yes. How may I help you? Are you the one who's attracting the wolves? Wolves? What wolves? Who are you exactly? I'm Antea Duarte. This is Red McWraith. We're banishers. Do you know what that means? Banishers? That means... You can speak to the living on behalf of the dead. That's part of it, yes. Why, do you have someone in mind? Ferdinando Miller. My Fardy. Death parted us. But my love is strong. I came back for him. I love him so. But not once has he come to see me. I must know why. New Eden's a big place. Where can we find him? We were on our way to Fort Jericho. We were to open a store together. It was to be a new beginning for us both. Together. Yet he's there, alone. If you know where he is, why not just go there? I've tried. At first I was able to visit him. In the quiet, as he slept, I'd watch over him. But now, something hinders me. I cannot reach him. I must know that he is well. There's no delicate way to ask this, I'm afraid. How did you die? We left civilization in New Eden Town for the cold desert of Fort Jericho. The path was steep and rough, and we were greatly burdened. It was hell, but we walked through it together. As we walked, I fell into a daze. I remember little after that. A pain that grew, a great, uncontrollable tremor. Fatigue, a deathly fatigue. Fadi was at my side as ever. He held my hand, bade me sleep. When I opened my eyes, I was here, alone. How did you meet him? It was market day. I'll never forget it. It was rich, exotic, an abundance of treasures from across the known world. I saw him through the crowd. Our eyes met. I didn't know it then, but I was meeting the love of my life. I could not admit it to myself, not at first, but I had to have him. And in the end, I did. We have to go now. Find him, please. Bloody mongrel! Yeah, One less to worry about.
What are you thinking? It's more of a feeling. Something's wrong. Your senses are sharpening. She said... He didn't tell us everything. A peaceful place, in different times. Before the nightmare's influence, you mean? Let's reach the fort, and a fire, and warm you up. I feel something close. Trouble ahead. <laughs> 